I'm Lucy. Thanks for stopping by, and I hope you enjoy the video. I think I must have been about 12 to 13 years old when my siblings, my mother, and myself were living in an apartment building on the third floor in a not-so-nice city. I remember on this particular day, it was during the daylight hours when my brother, who was one year younger than me, and I were just the two of us at home that day. Our apartment consisted of a two bedroom and a long hallway that led to the living room. My brother and I were lying on the living room floor on our stomachs, looking up at the TV that sat on a table with our backs to the hallway behind us that led to our front door. We must have been watching something very entertaining on the TV that we were oblivious to what was happening right behind us. There was a stranger that had managed to force open our front door and had already stuck one leg inside of our apartment, when thankfully our dog's consistent growling and barking finally caught our attention. As we looked back, we saw this stranger's leg and our dog biting his leg. We heard the man screaming at our dog to stop while he was shaking his leg. The man was now trying to get his leg back outside, apparently trying to leave. As I immediately jumped up, I ran towards the door and screamed to my brother to come help me. We were pushing the door with all our might in the hopes of closing it and keeping this strange man out. And in doing so, this stranger's man's leg was now caught between the door, where he was now trapped, while my dog was not letting go of his leg, and where my brother and I, even though we were terrified and screaming for help, were overcome with incredible strength, and we somehow managed to slam the door shut and lock it. While we now stood with our backs to the door, still pressing up against it, in fear that the stranger could somehow reopen the door again, we stood up against the door for a long time, afraid to let go of it. With our courageous and loyal dog right by our side the whole time, who knows what kind of intentions the stranger had and what type of danger we were in or what would have happened to us. I can only imagine if it wouldn't have been for the selfless and heroic act of our dog, who was bravely and blindly giving her life to defend us. Thanks for stopping by. I hope you enjoyed the video and please come back to see the next one. Be blessed. Bye.